Hi guys, my name is Mike Holt and I'm one of our deputy chiefs uh, here at the Florence Police Department. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say uh, to commend everybody and tell you what a great job you've been doing with your social distancing uh, and just trying to do your part uh, to, to help what's going on right now. So uh, first of all, you're doing a great job. Second of all, I'd like to take a few moments uh, out of my lunch break today, uh, maybe read the boys and girls uh, a uh, quick little book and maybe give mom and dad a little break uh, just for a couple of minutes, but uh, just read a quick book uh, for all the boys and girls that are home uh, from school or your daycares uh, when you're normally uh, not in the house. So today we're gonna read Pig the Winner. Here we go. Pig was a pug, and I'm sorry to say, if he didn't come first, it would ruin his day. Yes, Pig was a winner. He just had to win. And nothing would stop him. Oh, where to begin? So he's number one up there. Believe it or not, he was quite hard to beat. And the reason was simple. Yes, Pig was a cheat. Uh-oh. But if he did lose, he'd throw a pink fit. He'd scream and he'd cry, and he just wouldn't quit. He'd sob and he'd sulk with a quivering chin till you gave up and said to him, okay, you win. But as soon as you said it, he'd clap and he'd stamp, and he'd rub it in loudly that he was the champ. He's not playing very nice, is he? Trevor would say to him, let's just have fun. But Pig would reply, it ain't fun till I've won. So one night at supper, Pig shouted with glee, who can eat faster? I bet that it's me. Trevor said shyly, I don't want to race. But Pig had yelled go and was stuffing his face. He wolfed down his food, he gobbled his kibble. His face was awash with biscuits and dribble. Yuck. He chomped up three sausages, all of them whoppers. Then he munched through his doggy treats, gnashing his choppers. He swallowed it, he swallowed it all in a minute or less. But something went wrong. Do you know? Can you guess? Wonder what happened? Because he was busy stuffing his hole, Pig didn't notice. He'd swallowed his bowl. Don't eat too fast, kids, and swallow your plate. Lucky for Pig, Trevor knew what to do. He squeezed out the bowl before Pig could turn blue. But Pig didn't thank him. He just said, I win. Then the bowl bounced right back and knocked Pig in the bin. These days it's different, I'm happy to say. Pig's not the winner each time that they play. He plays to have fun and his tantrums have ceased. Yes, Trevor can win now. Well, Sometimes at least. I think Pig still cheats just a little bit. The end. Well, that was a fun story, right? So don't be like Pig. Uh, play play nice with, uh, with your friends and your brothers and sisters that you're in the house with right now that you're not normally uh, around this much. Sometimes you'll win, sometimes you'll lose, and that's okay. Uh, so again, I hope the kids enjoyed the story. Uh, I hope the, your parents enjoyed that very brief break. Uh, hopefully it held their attention for a few moments. Hey guys, keep up the good work. Uh, you're doing a great job. Uh, just keep it up. Everything's going to be just fine. Things will be back to normal before you know it. Uh, and have a great day. And God bless. <laughs>